PKD Nambiar, isn't it just incredibly sad? And like I said at the very outset, you know, we're not we're not questioning these notices or the fact that this was done illegally or anything. It's just extremely sad to see a 90-year-old guru, we, we call him guru, to be treated in the manner that he was. And several other uh, artists who are facing eviction notices, several others who've complied and left. Vishika, well, I do sympathize for the guru who had given his life for the art and our culture of our country. And the way it has been treated is absolutely not the right way. But of course, you know, some of our officials may not be, it may not be a stand of a government that to ill-treat a uh, guru like him. The problem is that, but you need to also understand, there is no, uh, any government accommodation is not permanent for anyone. Can you just imagine that few a few months ago, no, Sarath Yato, one of the veteran, veteran locks, uh, I mean, uh, Nobody's uh, questioning of that. country who had spent uh, a lot of time in, uh, to the this thing, he had been asked to go. Today is the day, like for an example, in AK Antony, who was the former defense minister, some of, he is vacating his house and leaving. So it is, uh, you cannot have a permanent uh, government facility forever.